beats everybody has a car. He beats everybody together. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Welcome. Your visitor already entered my forest while well, Origin sleeps. Thank you. Then we'll see you when you get back. Wait, Professor Genus. Elder, please let these two into the village. It's only for now. They're my close friends and I want them to be there when I face off against Krontos. Unthinkable! No half of may enter our village. That kind of attitude gave race to Crucius. What did you say? Stop, both of you. The kind of the Esper, the server is us from the half hills is deep and dark. Near this, there is a reason in what you say. Thus, from now on, from now on till region is released, I will grant these two interests to the village. Thank you. However, they may not use any of our facilities. Is that clear? That's fine. Gee, thanks. Yeah, let's go to where Krontos is. Wait, wait. You should relax a little bit first. You're about to fight your father, remember? I know that. Claire is right. Don't be hazy, Lloyd. The fate of the world rests on your battle with Krontos. Let's rest here tonight and you sort out your feelings. This will be the end of our journey. All right. Hey, you know how they say, he who chased two hares won't catch either? Hares? How do you catch hares? You mean you chase someone and grab them by the hair? You know, Lloyd, sometimes I think you're a true genius. <laughs> Thanks, Genus. That wasn't a compliment. What it means is if you get greedy and try to get everything, you fail. Like me. Genus. I want to be friends with both you and Mythos. Mythos was the first friend I ever had that I was since well, oh, that was my race. But in the end, with my own hands, I... I'm sorry, Genus. He was your friend, I... I don't want you to apologize for that. Is this Mito's Crucius Crystal? I'm sorry. I picked it up in the Tower of Salvation, but I couldn't bring myself to destroy it. I took it with me. I, I thought I at least show him the regenerated world. I see. Lloyd, don't do anything you will regret. That's all I want to say. What is it? Ah, nothing. Are you feeling uneasy? What? If you don't kill Krontos, Origin will not be released. Even if you somehow manage to avoid fighting, you still have to release Origin. If you release Origin, Krontos might die, and you're right back where you started. Yeah, I want to talk to him. With him. I want to ask him if there is any other way. You must be prepare yourself for a possible that or isn't. Professor. I'm sorry. I always say things so coldly. No, you say the harsh things on purpose. It's for our benefit. Thank you. Lloyd. Tonight I'll make up my mind about whether or not I will kill Krontos. Yo, I'm in a really bad mood, just so you know. 
What are you talking about all of a sudden? I just can't accept the way he acts, you know, Prontos. I'm sorry. You don't need to apologize. Well, yeah, but... Well, I guess you're his son, but I gotta say, the way he decided to leave the job of selling things up to you is just, like, really irresponsible. It's like he's trying to run away from the solution. <laughs> when you start putting people down, uh, putting down people, even Kratos is unsafe. Lloyd, if you're having trouble finding the answer, just chant my special magic words. Spe special magic words? Whatever will be, will be. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, what the hell is the man in the free? Sitting here. It just doesn't seem real that the world is heading towards destruction. Yeah, if the Great Sea doesn't wake up, this world will. What, what we're doing may be against the laws of nature. What? People chose the path of destruction. What we're trying to do may be nothing more than meaningless extension the lifespan of the world. Are you saying it's better if the world is destroyed? I don't know. I don't think anyone knows what is best. That's why you having a you having difficulty deciding. Perseia. There may not be a correct path, so please choose whatever you really believe for yourself. Thanks, Perseia. I like how some people just stand up after you talk with someone, They're like, no. Be like, shut up, Sheree. Shut up, TK. Shut up, everybody. Show myself. Now I have to talk to Colette. <laughs> you look tired. Really? Christmas has was destroyed, but a bigger problem still remains. It's only natural that you are fatigued. But this is the end. I didn't expect to fight Kratos in the end. I understand well your desire for one your father to live. And your desire to reunite the world as well. Yeah, if I don't do anything, the world will wither and everyone will die. In times like this, you have two options. Choose what you desire to do or what you must do. Hey, are you alright? What? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. You're not someone who will answer that question with a no. I'm so stupid. Sheena, no, I'm really okay. I just have hesitations. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. Anyone would be confused. This thing with Krontos was so sudden. But there's no time for that. For it. I have decided. I can't. We were back and forth wanting to save both, like the way I was with Colette. A father and son battling to death. Horrible. Sheena, you don't have to make yourself feel bad about it. Thank you. 
I'll think long and hard about it. I find an answer that won't make you feel that way again. I'm sorry, I couldn't cheer you up. No, don't worry about it. Thanks. Sure, you jealous bitch. Are you ready to go to bed? Not yet. Lloyd, it will be all right. But why are you saying all of, all of a sudden? Oh, uh, well, see, I have good luck. Even though I was a chosen, I was a chosen who was supposed to die. Thanks to you, I'm here and alive. Yeah. When you and the others are sad, I'm sad. And so, to make sure I don't get sad, you won't let anything ha sad happen to you. <laughs> Sorry. Don't apologize. Thanks. No, I'm really sorry I don't have anything else to say I can say. You adorable little bastards. What is it? Are you still up? I couldn't really get to sleep. The stars are so pretty. Do you want to come see them with me? Okay then. Just for a little while. Wow. It feels like they might come falling down at any moment. Yeah. It still feels strange. The fact that I'm still here talking. How come? My grandmother told me that I could never return to the village once I left on the journey to regenerate the world. So when I talked with you the night before leaving Asalia, I thought it would be the very last time. But I'm still here, right beside you. And that's the way it'll be. Hmm? Crucius is gone, and tomorrow, when I win against Kratos and have him remove the seal, the worlds will be reunited. You don't have to worry anymore. So, you're going to fight Kratos? I... have to. But, he's your father. It's because he's my dad that I have to fight. Why? He wants to settle things. He wants to settle the score with his own past. That's what it feels like to me. Hmm. Maybe you're right. After all, he saved us. Yeah. And I also want to settle things myself. What do you mean? I've spent this whole time expecting you to do everything. I just took it for granted that you're the only one who could regenerate the world. I never questioned that. You didn't know. It's not your fault. And besides, you saved me. Just like you promised you would. But because of that, a lot of people lost their lives. I have to shoulder their sacrifices. For their sake and mine, I have to defeat the Kratos of the past. I understand. When this is all over, I hope the world becomes a place where everyone can live together. When this journey ends and the world really becomes like that, what are you going to do? Will you return to Isalia? I don't think I'm going back there again. I plan to go on a journey to collect all of these. Experts? Unless they're all retrieved, there'll be more victims like you and Persea. So I want to gather all of them before that happens. That's my way of showing gratitude to these guys for using their powers to fight. Do you mind if I come along with you? Hmm? I want to continue to be by your side, just like I've been up until now. All right, we'll go together. Let's go explore the new world together. Okay. Aw, that's so cute. <laughs> what the haters? What the haters? Well, excuse them, Sheree. 
<laughs> what? Fuck the hoops. <gasps> oh, crap. Are you going to this warm forest? Yeah. Kratos traveled the world in search of the legendary orb, Onus. He came here too, of course. Do you know why? In order to allow a human to wield the internal sword, right? So you can wield it, but in the end, Onus will not be found in this world. It had to be taken from the across. So that's why he sends us to get it. And if you can avoid the battle, do not forget. Kratos was your ninth companion. I won't. Torba lies this way. Speak to the watchman. of the elves. Since you are a little bit of 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 a little a English. This place is very confusing, so pay attention. Go up to the top until you see the little hand. Oh, I can't remember this. I hate this. As long as Genesis is alive. うん。そうみたいだね。ずっと私たちの個体寿命は、せいぜい80年です。そうではない。ジーニアスやリフィルが死なない限り、我々も心の中で生き続ける。うん。僕、みんなを忘れないよ。ああ。でも、he Follow him with the path exactly where he goes and exit the alchemy. On the X scene, shoot the stump as well. We watch him run into the break. Come back here! これ、強くなったかな。ロイドは強いよ。クラトスよりも。それは。あいつとは今までに何度か戦ったけど。あいつは本気じゃなかった。今度あいつが手を抜いたら、俺はあいつを許さない。ロイド。本気で戦って、あ
Curse the monster. What was in that um, chest? Let's start with the angel tears. Come back here. Oh, I forgot I got, got new weapons for him. Angel Tear. They had no chance to hit us, the big gold dragon.
beautiful. Yes. Middle stage. Oh my god, Spot Fenty, go up. Make your first right I'm on the way she can stop. So, you've come. Is there no other way? Are you still thinking like that? You'll die if you fight me with any doubt left in your heart. If you want the pact with Origin, then you must defeat me. So, that's your way. Everyone, leave this to me. You're going to fight alone? Lloyd won't lose. Lloyd bears the weight of all the lives that you and Crucius sacrificed. Get ready! Oh, shit! <sighs> I'm not gonna hold back this time. I know. I won't either. Let's go. strong thanks to you aren't you going to finish me i've defeated kratos the angel the one who betrayed us and i forgive kratos the hero of the ancient war who helped us that's all <sighs> and i thought i'd finally earned the right to die but you are as soft-hearted as ever <gasps> hold on you can't be are you going to break the seal? That is what you desire, is it not? But then you'll... Kratos! 
Don't worry, he's alive. I gave him some of my mana. Dad! Kratos! Are you really okay? Looks like I failed to die once more. <laughs> you stupid jerk! You can die any time, but when you die, that's the end. You want him to live in eternal damnation? Who said anything like that? What will you accomplish by dying? Nothing. There is no meaning in dying. You're right. To think I had to have my son teach me such an obvious lesson. Kratos! Kratos will be fine. Form the pact with Origin. <laughs> Why are you stupid jerk? <laughs> Have fun, you stupid jerk. Aquaman! You who lack the right. I have lost faith in all things. Have you come here to disappoint me as well? Origin, are you bound by a pact to Mythos? My pact with Mythos was broken the moment I was freed. Never again shall anyone make use of my power. Even if we make a vow, we need the Eternal Sword. I want to use the Eternal Sword to reunite the two and revive the giant Carlon tree. Unless we do something, the worlds will never stop vying for mana and everyone will suffer. That situation was born from the weakness of creatures who are unable to accept those that are different. That may be true, but mistakes can be corrected. Some things cannot be corrected. Even so, we have to do everything we can. Exactly. I'm not gonna give up. From the moment they are born, everyone has the right to live. I want to reclaim that. Humans, elves, half-elves, dwarves, and even summon spirits. Everyone has a right to life. Origin. For almost an eternity, I thought that the only way to save this world was to cling to Mythos's ideals. Just as you once agreed with Mythos's ideals, I too thought his was the only way. But Lloyd is different. He taught me that in order to change something, you must do it yourself. It is not enough to merely rely on someone else and go along with their ideals. You who possess the right of summoning, make your vow. Origin! I will try once more to believe in people. I shall do my duty in order to create a world you speak of. A world in which everyone can live equally. I, Sheena, have but one vow. To reclaim a world in which everyone can live freely. A world in which no life is sacrificed meaninglessly. Then we shall create a pact upon that vow. Now fight! Oh shit, here we go. Oh! Oh, look at him! Oh, shit! Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Here we go. I heard ma magic is good. Not much of a Oh, 
XP and then go. We got David Graham though. Act maker Sheena and Lloyd, I place my power in your hands. With that power, transform the Eternal Sword into a blade to save all life. However, the Eternal Sword remains, as by Mythos's pact, unusable by those who lack the blood of elves. You must master the sword by your own power, and forge a new bond with it. There's no time. I'll take your body. Uh, no! No, it's Mythos. He survived in the Crucius Crystal. Lloyd's body will be taken over unless we do something. Lloyd! go there's no what's that <laughs> it's like a spaceship of some sort the route to Daris Carlock. Damn. We'll evacuate the elves for now. The entire village will be destroyed unless we do something. Oh 
no, that person trapped on the rocks. How many times they gotta kill that collect? Well, he was about to take you. Save me! Thank you so much! Leave while the others of this village are remaining in the village to the end. We're evacuating the remaining people. So what now? I cannot. I cannot believe I'm being saved by humans and half elves. How do you say things like that at a time like this? Yes, we may have been foolish. I trust my villagers to you. Grab a son. That is Daris Carlo. Impossible. How could a planet exist so close? It is the eternal sword that makes the impossible possible. It was hidden by the protective barrier projected from the Tower of Salvation, but it has always existed there for 4,000 years. Yes. And now Mythos, with the great seed in hand, is trying to leave this land and take Daris Carlon with him. Tabitha, you're feeling better? Yes. Wait a minute. Daris Carlon is a massive mana. And the great seed is the seed of the giant tree, right? If he takes both of them, what's gonna happen to this world? It will wither and die from mana deprivation. This is a much bigger problem than reuniting the world. What the hell are you guys talking about? Our friend just got kidnapped. What are we gonna do, Lloyd? What else? We're going after Mythos. But the Tower of Salvation was destroyed. Use the Eternal Sword. If you really made a pact with Origin, the sword will surely respond to you. With its power over time and space. 
But Altessa is not well enough to move. Who's going to craft the Ring of the Pact? Dad. Dirk? Yeah. He's our only hope. We'll go to Silverant. Wait. I'm going with you. All right. Yay. <laughs> I'll go with you. Yay. Good job, Holly. Why is it tense with this baby? That is so wrong to work. Doc! We can't mean, man! Oh, look at me in the sky. Oh, I got a scary looking. Purple. no one else. The dwarf that has the skills is unable to move. Dad, please. I've gathered all of the necessary items. This is adamantite for polishing. Hmm. What's this piece of wood? Is this sacred wood? This must fuel the fire. Is that why you were traveling all over Tetheala? To prepare all of this? <sighs> I see. So everything is set. I can't very well refuse after you've gone through so much trouble now, can I? And I suppose it won't hurt me to help out my dearest son. After all, I'm his father too. Dwarven vow number one. Work together for the sake of a peaceful world. All right. Let's do it. With this, I'll be able to use the Eternal Sword, right? Dad! Kratos! What's wrong? Lloyd, you've really grown stronger. I never expected you to be able to inflict such a serious wound on my angelic form. Take this, and stop Mythos. I don't think I'll be able to help you anymore. Okay. That's a marvelous blade. I doubt you have a sword in your possession to match it. Really? Take this with you. It's a present I promised you. Now that you've grown all up, I can entrust <laughs> you with the, the greatest sword, sword I ever forged. See, so if, if you got the one for the sword, it'll be, it'll be meaningless. Wow. But if you have it, I'll be become <laughs> even stronger with these two So Thanks, Dad. And Kratos. Beautiful. I'm sorry I forced everything upon you. I have great dads. One made a ring for his son using the lost arts, and another risked his life to protect his son in secrecy. Yeah? You've got great parents. Yeah. Well, I'm off. Dad. Everyone, let's go. <laughs> All I got souls is wet. Are y'all guys forgetting one thing? I can't not kidnap. <laughs> oh my god, he had that in the Tales of World. Yep. It's beautiful. Are you sure you don't want to fake? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Save. If you defeated the third sword chance of this weapon, this weapon will be meaningless. <laughs> okay guys, 